Okay, this is the absolute shortest um, way to describe to you why Illinois is a prairie today. If you asked a geologist, why is Illinois a prairie state? Why are the soils such that we grow prairie? You would get a very different story than what you're expecting because he's going to want to start with you back 540 to 325 million years ago and let you know that at one time, which a lot of you will remember, we were covered by a shallow ocean. We didn't even exist as what we see today in any shape or form. That ocean was there for a very long time and left lots and lots of sandstone, which are all the crustaceans and all that crushed and layered into sedimentary rocks. Uh, a lot of shell remnants when you find a fossil with, in the sedimentary rock. There are areas in Illinois that are three miles deep with sand below your feet. Now, they may go on to tell you that this is the United States, by the way, we're here in Illinois, that 325 to 290 years ago, those oceans receded and they were replaced with huge river basins. And those river basins left mud and silt. And those river basins also were part of a delta system. Deltas are your wet, swampy, marshy areas. Yes, it was very similar to a rainforest. Of course, the dinosaurs coming along within that and after that loved, you know, that moist air and all that and such. But that's not a prairie state. That, that doesn't say prairie at all. To hurry that system up, I'm not a geologist. I'm going to take you back. Now, lots of things happened in between 70 million years ago. Between that 70 million years and that 290 million years ago, lots happened. Lots of soil layers came on. Lots of history in the rock. But 70 million years ago, we had an event called the Laramide orogeny. And that Laramide time frame, that orogeny, was when the north, north and western mountains were, were created due to lots of geological description of plates and mushing and mashing. And I'm not going to go into that because we're trying to figure out why we're prairie. And here's why. This is one of the main reasons why we became the, the, known as the tall grass prairie state. You have the jet stream. The jet stream comes from the Pacific side and goes to the Atlantic side, that direction, the majority of the time. When you take something major, like the Rocky Mountains, and the Earth decides right up through here during that 70 million to 80 million year time frame years ago, those mountains came up right in the way of the jet stream. Okay? When you put something that big in the way of air, it's going to stop the air. And that moist air was halted. Everything on the California side, uh, Washington, Oregon, beautiful. Lots of moisture, halted. Now that, if you think about it, that would be why, as it's gaining a little bit of moisture from the water cycle taking place, maybe a little bit when the jet streams come up and over through Canada, bringing some snow moisture in the winter. Nebraska, for instance, it's a short grass state. They grow wheat. The soils and the temperatures, the climate, the moisture is all appropriate for growing short grass, including prairie grass, but one of their largest commodities is wheat. Wheat is a short grass. Now, as you come over toward Illinois, that's my weak version of Illinois right there, all right? You're adding water, not only this jet stream, you're getting water now from the Gulf of Mexico. And this is where a lot of that water flows. You're getting reverse you know, the, oh, the lake effect moisture from Lake Michigan. So now you've got just enough moisture. Now you have tall grass. Uh, we grow corn. Corn's one of our major commodities. In the summer, if you eat corn, you're eating grass seeds with butter on it. Corn is a tall grass. We have the appropriate climate and soils for tall grass. That is why today we are now the, the tall grass prairie state. Without the mountains, we probably never would have gotten to that level of climate perfection to become the tall grass prairie. And that's the smushed version of why we are today Illinois the tall grass prairie state.